Hi Angela, thanks so much for your comments on my post. I appreciate them. Um, interesting, I had not thought about how we label kids even um, differently, but yeah, we label them too, you know, I, and my daughter is a third grade teacher this year, uh, but it's so true. Um, we do label them, and she doesn't talk about them necessarily by color of skin. She does talk about them frequently. Well, he comes, you know, he's a foster kid, or she's a, you know, HDA or ADHD, and she's, you know, da 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 da. So interesting. I had not even picked up on that, how we do label children. And um, now I know in the medical field, you know, certain ethnic people do have different um, risk factors for different diseases. So that that does, while we still call them, you know, 65-year-old uh, Asian whatever, Asian man has blah, 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 some of it is because of um, their predisposed, um, their heritage predisposes them to different disease processes, but had not thought about it on the kid's side. So very interesting, and I appreciated that comment. I didn't want to make this a long post. So anyway, I appreciate that um, that input there, and yeah, you, yeah, great job. Thank you so much. We'll see you later.